over-the-counter high. There's a product popping up in stores throughout the metro. Shannon Halligan went to find out just how easy it is to get. It's the latest craze known as Kratom. And Shannon, what does law enforcement have to say about this? Yeah, they're pretty concerned. This little packet costs just $10 at a shop down the street, but health officials say this stuff is addicting and potentially very dangerous. It's advertised right there on the door. Kratom. It's not illegal, but it is listed on the Drug Enforcement Administration's list of drugs and chemicals of concern and can be addicting. We sent our producer into a store to see how easy it is to purchase a packet. The clerk checked to make sure he was over 18, then showed their selection of Kratom. The powder cost 10 bucks. Vicki Ward, manager of prevention services at Tri-County Mental Health, warns parents about the dangers of these products. Youth whose brains are not fully developed, anytime they take any substance that is addictive, then they can develop lifelong issues with addiction. Kratom may be legal, but it isn't regulated. And that's just it. You don't know. You do not know what you're getting. Platt County Prosecutor Eric Zond works to get ahead of changing drug trends. These new designer drugs, the problem is you end up uh, a victim of an overdose and go to an emergency room. Emergency room personnel don't even know where to start. And Zahn warns, just because it's not banned doesn't mean you can't get in trouble. If you're caught driving with it and impaired because of it, you'll be charged just like somebody who was charged um, with a traditional alcohol uh, DWI. Well, Kratom is native to Thailand and it's actually been banned there since 1943. Live in the newsroom, Shannon Halligan, 41 Action News.